The Heresiology of Epiphanius, Bishop Entitled Panarion or Medicine Church. From 2. As I begin my account and discussion of faith and unbelief, of correct views and divergent views, I'm going to start by mentioning the world's creations by the world's creation and what follows and what follow it. Though I am not beginning by my own power or my own reasoning, but as God, the Lord of all, the merciful, has for self to reveal the knowledge of everything to his prophets and told them as far as human nature allows to us. And I feel quite anxious as the old said, as soon as I begin to consider the subject. Indeed, I am extremely frightened at undertaking attacks of no small difficulty, and I call on the Holy God himself, on his only begotten Son Jesus Christ, and only and on by his Holy Spirit, to give light to my poor mind for its illumination with the knowledge of these things. For the Greeks, for the Greek authors, poets, and chronicles, who, who will invoke a muse when they undertook some work of mythology, a muse, not God, the wisdom was the village, early and not descended from above, as, as scripture says. I, however, am calling upon the Holy Lord of all to come to the aid of my poverty and inspire me with His Holy Spirit so that I may include nothing spurious in my treatment of the subject. And having made this very petition, for according to the measure of faith and in, pro and in proportion, I now might need the question, I beseech him to grant it. To a person reading a work of, on any question that at the aim of the treatises ought to be clear, the discoveries which, train in, which training enables my small mind to grasp lie in the temporal realm, I, and I certainly do not, do not promise to impact the knowledge of everything in the world. There are things which cannot be uttered, and things which can. There are things untold beyond counting, inaccessible, so far as, so far as man is concerned, and not only to the Lord of all, but we are dealing with, with variants of opinions and kinds of knowledge, with, with, with faith in God and unbelief, with sex, and with heretical human opinion, which misguided persons, which have been serving in the world for man's formation on earth till our own day, the eleventh year of the reign of Valentinians and Valens and the, and the seven of Gratians. Some of the things about sex and schisms which I, which I shall be telling the reader, I owe to my fondness for study. Certain things I learned for her sake, though I happen on some with my own, my own ears and eyes. I am confident that I can give an account for a correct report of the origins and teachings of some sex, uh, and, part of the and part of the what goes on among uh, the others. Of this letter, I know now. I know one from the works of ancient authors, another by listening to learned men who confirm my notion precisely. I did not gather all this reflection together on my own initiative, or by spending further time on subjects which go beyond my limited intelligence. In fact, I have also written this work, which, by God's will, I urge my I ask my weakness. I ask my weakness on at various times and in various ways, and practically force me to get at it. Such a case, such a request, your honors, made in writing, my most esteemed brothers and scholarly fellow presbyters, Acacius and Paul, in a letter of recommendation. Now, since not without God's help. I, am, I have given the fullest consideration to the number of requests, and from extreme love for the servants of God, have consented to take the step. I shall begin, not with eloquence of language of any Polish expresses, but with plain speech in a, in a plain dialect, dialect, 
but with accuracy of facts of my speech conveys. The other Nikander, the other Nikander too, gave an account of the nature of beasts and reptiles, and other authors describe the qualities of roots and plants. Dioscurides, the Dioscurides, the woodcut, the woodcutter, Pamphilus, king of Mithridates, Callisthenes, Philo, Iolaus of Bithynia, Heraclitus of Tarentum, Catenus of Good, Catenus the Good Collector, Andrew, Jesus the Tullian, Nicaratus, Petronus, Niger, Diodotus, and certain others. In the, in the same way. I, in trying to reveal the rules and beliefs on the, of the sex, am not describing them in order to harm those who care to read my description. Those authors made a diligent effort not to point evil out but to frighten people and ensure their safety so that they would recognize the dreadful, dangerous beasts and be safe and, es and, be, and, be safe and escape them by God's power by taking care not engage with such deadly creatures if they encountered them, but were well managed by their beast of right or by sight of them, and at the same time, for the same concern, the same author the same authors prescribed remedies made from roots and plants to counteract the evil of the serpents. Thus, dearest, my work too has been compiled as a device against them. And for you self and your and for your safety, to reveal the appearance of the dreadful serpents and beasts, and their potions and their po po poisons, and deadly bites, and to correspond with this, I shall give as any as many arguments, like antidotes, as I can, in such compass, or one or two at most to contract the poisons the poison and out of the Lord cure anyone who wants to be cured if he has fallen willingly and inadvertently into this snake into the snake like stitchings of the sex.